Oh my goodness! What was that? Emotional damage! Hey guys, welcome back. Did not have time to do a proper intro here, but uh, we're fishing a tournament again. Kayak tournament. We're all in Spavinol right here. And uh, it's pretty hard trying to get a bite. Pretty hard trying to get a bite. The lake is usually clear and now it's pretty dirty. Beyond stain. Visibility is about four inches. I'm trying to find a needle in the haystack right here out of this grass flat, but I've been doing this for like an hour now. It's just some old spots with a chatterbait, but I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's going to work, so I'm about to give up on this in about 15 minutes if we can't get nothing done. And go beat the bank, I guess. I don't know what else to do. Okay, we give up on the offshore thing. I've tried everything I know for an hour. Black chatterbaits, white chatterbaits, all different sizes. So give up on that. Go to the bank. We're hitting the uh, laydowns, trees, anything we can see. And with a wacky rig, you know, this is my favorite wacky rig setup. And even that has gone. So plan B is out the window. And with no practice, you just have to fish what's in front of you and fish what you believe should work. So plan C. This rod and reel setup, uh, usually I throw an umbrella into it. It's a 7 6 heavy action. I got it all on, uh, I think it was either 20 or 25 pound line. Quarter ounce weight, 5 on hook with a custom color from uh, Missile Baits. It's a limited edition red. And uh, seems like they wanted it today. Flipping by boys, that flipping by. Oh, they spawning. They spawning already. Damn. Yes, sir. That's a pre spawn right there. That's a pre spawn right there. Oh, come on. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Is it 20? Hold on guys, hold on. Big mama on board right here. Big mama on board. Big mama. Oh my goodness! What was that? Oh my goodness! What was that? Just to let you guys in on a little secret, I still got emotional damage from that bite. It's been about 24 hours since the bite.
Yes, sir. That's two. 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 Alright, cool, we good, we good. So just when you thought the wood flipping thing is gonna work, it dries up. So for about an hour, couldn't get nothing going on the wood, so I decided to go see if I could find some spotting fish. Ran up the lake a little bit, went to a pocket, found some signs but nothing real good, not a lot of activity in the back of the pockets, at least where I was at. So decided to come back out to the main lake and gamble on the offshore spot that I, you know, first started at. Maybe now the sun's out, it might change your mood. So anyways, all the way out, fish these stick-ups with a swim jig, uh, bluegill pattern, and fireworks, man. And I ended up staying there for the rest of the day. Do this. It's been a while, guys. It's been a while. Whew. All right, we're on the outside. Outside grass, huh? Outside grass, huh? Whew. Outside grass, huh? All right. See how it is. There we go guys, we got one, that's number three. So the crazy thing about tournament fishing that I don't think a lot of people understand is you have a lot of skills and sometimes your skills are going to be pushed to the limits. And this tournament is one of those days. Uh, we didn't practice, came in blind, conditions are completely different from what we projected and we didn't get a third fish until 1.30. Mine's at 2.30. So in the last hour you were challenged with you got to catch three big ones in an hour. In an area you're, you've never fished before, but you fished situations like this before. So you gotta feel pretty confident going in. And uh, I feel like I did pretty good. Come on, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. These are the winged fish, boys. These are the winning fish. Mm, come on. Come on, let's go, let's go. All right, guys, 16.75. That's a good one. That's a good one. All right, 30 minutes to go. 30 minutes to go. You got four fish, you need a fifth one. We're basically bombing our swim jig as far as it can go, and it bumps everything on the way back. And one time or another, when it, when it bumps something, I think it causes a reaction strike, and one of the fish is going to grab it. So here we go. Let's find a fish of the day. Decent size, decent size. Mm. Let's go. Mm. Feels good, man. Feels freaking good. That's why we do it. This is why we tournament fish. Because ain't nobody else can provide you with this type of fun, man. I'm telling you. Let's go. Let's go. All right, boys. 18 three quarters. Let's go. 
Let's go. Mm, we got one more to go. One more big one to go. We got this. Let's go. Pumped. Finally figured out the pattern. Simple pattern. Simple, simple pattern. That's it. That's the tournament. So we had a good day, considering no practice and no idea what to do. You did all right. Woo! Echo, I can't run off. Oh, you beat me. I got 86. Did you really? Yeah. Are you lying? No, I'm not lying. Are you live? Yeah. I haven't seen you the best on a while, so I had to get it in, you know. It's true. Yeah. <laughs> and I ran all the way back to the creek. I, saw, I think I saw, it was either you or your brother. I didn't it, was probably me. it was probably me. You fished I was in the middle of nowhere and then I went to the left. And I fished, I flipped the trees. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's probably you did. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, you know. Get the cows from the other side of town. Come spinnerbait. Spinnerbait! I didn't catch on spinnerbait. Yeah. Out of flip, flip, out of flip trees. No lay down. That's probably why, because you already caught them all. <laughs> I only caught one in that area. I oh, picked yeah? up a little bit of trash. I, I threw a spinner bait. I couldn't get that going. I threw a square bill. I think I had one on square bill, but I was too dumb to set the rusty, you know? And then uh, I flipped uh, I flipped a D bomb, okay? So I got a big one on D bomb. And then I, I flipped one over a lay down, and it bit me, and I swung so hard it went flying. But it, it, the, the hook never got him. I don't know how that works. <laughs> the hook never got him. It was flying in the air and the hook never got him. And then, all oh, right, what's this? Huh? 85 and a half. I guess. Oh, yeah, all right. I think you want. Man, I hurt. Sorry, I'm talking about an umbrella, Rick. Don't even ask me. Nah. Come on, turn around. I tried it. it you tried work. it? What'd you, what'd you catch them on? Uh, I actually flipped wood today. What? Yeah. What up? Yeah. Yeah. I'm not stepping out of his comfort zone. <laughs> All right. I had to do it. 288. 288. All right. All right. Thanks, man. Yeah. 288. Flip D bombs and trees, and then I threw a swim jig in the pickup. I was big flat. Okay.